it's not our fault. It's not mine. I'm not to blame. Neither am I. I'm bringing my dad if she starts on me. My nana will go berserk. Oh, because it's not our fault. Because I was smoking. When? Who is? You're frightened, aren't you? Me? No. You are. You're shaking. I'm cold. Look, it's not our fault, and we're not to blame. We were smoking by the sport shed. So? I'll take the blame for that, but not the rest. Can't help it. What? Feeling guilty. Well, don't. That's what they're waiting to hear, and then they'll drop a lot on you. I can't help it. That kid. Is he alright? I don't know, do I? He's only year seven. Just shut up, will you? You asked him to be there. Why was he there? The shed's our place. Little kids don't belong there. He's playing some kind of stupid game like truck or something. I don't know. He shouldn't have been there, should he? He keeps saying that, but he was, and now he's in hospital. Why are we messing around with worse than cans? It wasn't my idea. It was Dad's. I'm not having that dumped on me. Should have known something like this would have happened. When you go in there, you're on your own. I've got my story straight. I was having a smoke. Dad brought the cans. She made us light them for a laugh. It's her fault that kid got hurt. I never saw him come running around the corner of the shed. I was just aiming the flame at that dead tree and I never saw him. I, I, I didn't. You've got to get your story straight, Mouse, because they're not listening to that. <laughs>